hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video I'm going to show you how to fix error that is 0x80d02002 while updating Windows 10 to version 1909 or 1903 so please follow the steps shown in this video the first step is to run Windows update troubleshooter to run the troubleshooter go to the start menu and then click on settings then click on update and security and then click on troubleshoot click on windows update then click on run the troubleshooter so once the troubleshoot is done restart your computer and then try updating the windows 10 but still you are facing the problem then you have to restart the windows update services to restart windows update services you have to go ahead and type in powershell in windows search box and then make a right click on windows powershell then click on run as administrator then click on yes to allow now you have to run this command you have to first stop these services then you have to start all these services so just copy the command i provided this command in the video description so you can get it from there so copy this command and then go to the powershell window let me open PowerShell once again. Now paste the command, then hit the enter key on the keyboard. Then go to the second command. Hit the enter key. Now while running this command if you receive any kind of error message just ignore it and go to the next command. Now you have to start the services. Now once done, close this window and then restart your computer and then try updating Windows 10. If this does not resolve the problem, then you have to go ahead and run the DISM command. So again, after the restart, just type in PowerShell in Windows search box, then make a right click and then click on run as administrator, then click on yes to allow and run this command. This command is also provided in video description. So it will take couple of minutes to complete the scan. So once the scan is complete, once the scan is 100%, restart your computer and then try to update Windows 10 once again. So here you can see it's a 4.8 or 5, right now 5%. So let the scan be 100%. Once this is done, then you can go ahead and restart your computer and then update Windows 10. And that should fix the problem. Now still you're facing the problem, then you, you can use Windows 10 Update Assistant to update Windows 10. So open any browser and then type in Media Creation Tool. And go to the Microsoft website. then click on update now this will go ahead and download the update assistant on your computer so click on update now a exe file will download you have to run this exe file to open this tool click on yes to allow now this tool will go ahead and check the update and after that it will go ahead and update your windows 10 to the latest version and then you can close this tool and that should go ahead and update the Windows 10 to version 1903 or 1909. And the last step is to use media creation tool. So if nothing works, then media creation tool will definitely work. 
so you have to click on download tool now now this will actually download the complete windows 10 file along with the latest update so this process will take time it will go ahead and download around 4 to 5 GB of Windows 10 file along with the latest update. Now, depending upon the speed of your internet, it will go ahead and download the file. And after the download, you can go ahead and install the Windows. Do not worry about the data loss because uh, during the installation, it will give you an option to keep your personal files and apps. So if you select that option which says keeps your files and app, you will not lose any data on the computer. So do not worry about the data loss. So here you can see the exe file has downloaded so you have to run this exe file and once you run this the tool will come up on the screen. Now it's getting few things ready so it will take some time. Now here you have to go ahead and select the option which says upgrade this PC now. So I'll show you just uh, it will take some time it may be a couple of seconds so here you can see um, the terms so accept the terms and condition Now during the installation also it will take some time. The system will restart during the update. So do not worry about that. This is a long process but it will not only take care of the Windows update error. If you have any other issue with the operating system, it will go ahead and take care of it. So updating your Windows 10 using media creation tool not only take care of your update error but it also resolves many other issues. So select the first option which says upgrade this PC now. Then click on next and now it will start downloading the Windows 10 files and once the download is complete it, you can go ahead and install it now just during the installation just make sure that you select the option which says keep your personal files and app by default that option will be selected you have to just click on next and then update your Windows 10 so one of the step will definitely help you to resolve this problem thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel thank you